Hello Vaughn people, we are back. The long-awaited return of Cage 2 Foot Percent. Um, last time, I believe it was, we got through maybe three worlds, and then we did some finny fun in Atlantica. So I'm just uh, picking up where we parked last time, and uh, back at it again. So, controller going on the floor. Actually, that's an awkward wire situation. There we go. And uh, Mega Turtle 64 thank you for the follow. All right, got to get back into position here. Um, let me know on sound if it's too loud, too quiet. I will adjust accordingly. Um, although we are paused right now, so let's get unpaused. All right, God, it's been a minute. Um, and no promises that this goes until 9 o'clock. I might get fatigued and we might switch to another Blook It. Um, but we'll see what we can do. Um, yes, thank you, Nachos. Yeah, subscribe if you're watching the VODs. If you're just, like, refreshing your YouTube homepage to see if there's a new regular Pat Second Channel VOD, just hit subscribe, you know? And thanks, thank you for the shameless plug, the Nachos Almost Orbit collab. I guess we gotta fly to Caribbean now. Or Port Royal, rather. So that sucks. Um, we're using the Claw exclusively, which is right here. Um, I don't have any tiny ships, so we're gonna be kind of flying naked, unfortunately. Oh, right, I need to wear my glasses for these streams so I can see the chat, because I'm sitting further back, and I don't know where my glasses are. Big Velma hours. Um, and Mega Turtle, thank you for the sub there. For six months in advance, oh my god, I really appreciate that. Um, does Clough rhyme with bruh? Yeah, it seems to be, the way I'm saying it. What the fuck are my glasses? I'm just gonna... Hold my big toe on the fire button while I look around. Are they not on my desk? Son of a bitch. Mm. Oh, trying to crash into anything. Uh, they might be on my bookshelf. Um, and when I say bookshelf, I mean structure where I put my video games. <laughs> That's really what that is. Um, no books on it at all. Bump, bump. But, yeah, it's harder to read. Yeah, oh, to be a sexy librarian. Not everyone can pull it off, but I can. And I will. Um, okay, once we once we land, I'll go get my uh, my glasses. I really shouldn't be driving without my glasses, but here we are. Ha! Yeah, the gamer shelf. That's right. Um, and honestly, it's not big enough. I have, like, a lot of overflow here. And it's upsetting because I got this new shelf so I could have more room for my games, and it's not enough space. Um, I was able to fit like five more games. <laughs> it looked way bigger when I was buying it. Um, so, kinda sad. Anyway. Um, what about the case strategy guide and book with an odd number of angular manslaughters? God, what a, what a pull. Um, that's the, uh, the strategy guide video. Um, those books, I think I have in a bin. Um, it used to be on my end table. Now it's just KH stuff. My end table is like all KH related now. Oh! I should really look at the road. Um, God, I feel like I fought this guy like two days ago. Um, I got the Ultimania, I got the character files, I got a bunch of uh, the mangas and the novels on my end table. Um, the strategy guide is probably in my, in my cabinets there. Bonk, bonk. Yeah, I'm not sure where Great Gatsby is physically located right now, but it's nearby, I think. <laughs> um, use my feet exclusively to make my next video. It'll somehow, miraculously, take longer than it takes me to make a video using only my hands, so... Um, bam, bam, bam. Wah, wah. Oh god, can we just land already? I mean, this is actually one of the easier segments of the run. Oh, um. Yeah, I'm like, I'm blind. Sitting back here, like, I don't know. Wait, West Egg? I forget. I got my... My what? Oh, Ruby Blu-rays in... Only... Physical media? By physical media. See, like, I can't read, so... It's glasses time, baby. Be right back. Chippendale will keep you company, I guess. Glasses, glasses. There they are. 
Don't make fun of my blue shorts. Also, presto. What the fuck? Alright. Chippendale left. Sorry. Bad babysitters. Okay. No, not Chip. It's Chip Potts and Dale. A weird combination. Alright. Time to fight pirates. Haha, <laughs> blue shorts. <laughs> These are my athletic shorts that I do athletics in. Do we? <laughs> really? I've had these since uh, 2016. Um, brown frames. That's all I really know about them. Bum, 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 bum. I am due for uh, an appointment. Gorsh, everything looks fucking gross. Realistic. Disgusting. There. There. I'm still using Kingdom Key. Basically Amish. Am I basically Amish as well then? I do live in Pennsylvania. Bow, bow. Let's try to get some goodies, make sure that we're not falling behind on AP. I don't really know where the AP boosts are, but they're going to be in some of these chests. Um, Should I switch to, like, the gross rumbling rose? Oh. Ooh, my tummy's rumbling. Um, monochrome is overall better. Um, oh, wait, I don't get rumbling rose till second visit. Um... Or should I go for Hero's Crest? Probably higher on the strength, right? I'm not gonna be... What the fuck is going on? Uh, I'm not gonna be using a ton of magic. God damn it. Menuing is so arduous. Why wouldn't they design it so I could do it with my feet easier? Idiots. Um, there's a minor villain in the Tangled TV show named Dale. Um, yeah, okay. Yeah, Chip Potts and Tangled Hi. Dale. Match made in hell. Um, ba -ba 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 -ba. <laughs> Splash, how dare you? <laughs> I don't think anybody had the illusion that I'd be good at basketball prior to me standing up, so... Um, it's no use. Of the sports that we played in, like, middle school, expect. basketball was probably the one I had the least experience with. Um, we played a little bit of baseball. I guess not football. Although we would play, like... Um, we play football at recess sometimes, but I would they would just give me the ball and tell me to run. That was all I was good for. Um, ba -ba -dum, ba -ba -ba -dum. I, I have a vivid memory of running to the wrong end, and then someone yelling to me that I was going the wrong way, and I turned around and I still made it back. That was like my big hero moment. Like, he's dumb, but he's got the spirit, <laughs> you know? Um, we also played a lot of, uh, not a lot of, but we did some, uh, Volleyball. Volleyball is my favorite. If I had to pick a sport to play, that'd be the one. Unless we're counting dodgeball. But yeah, basketball, believe it or not, no good. Was not my, my forte. <clears throat> See, as a kid, like, as a, you know, like, 9 to 13, 14 year old, like, I was okay at sports. Like, I was decently athletic. I just didn't like the time commitment. Um, I never played on, like, actual teams in school because I didn't... I wanted to go home after school, <laughs> you know? Um, but I could keep up with people. I just didn't really like it. Now, once we got into high school, like, absolutely, I could not keep up with anybody. <laughs> I was not, uh, not athletic by then. <clears throat> but I feel like most children are fairly athletic because they still have a zest for life and the outdoors. And they like to run around and do shit. Yeah, I was pretty half and half on the video games and going outside as a kid. I don't know what the uh, what the pie chart looks like nowadays for for Gen Alpha. <sighs> I think I'm doing a better job of keeping my hands visible if I keep in this uh, Sora pose. So no one thinks that I'm cheating. Um. Oh yeah, like I did play, like when I was very young, we had t-ball. That was like through, just like the local town. Um, but I would totally just stand in the outfield and pick at grass or bugs. Um. Can I say that all of my least favorite uh people, and this is not against you, John, but all the kids that I did not like in middle school were lacrosse people. 
<laughs> Does that track for you? Or did you like your fellow lacrosse teammates? Because I'm sure you were one of the good lacrosse players, but that was like, they were my ops. The lacrosse people, and then in high school it was the wrestlers. Could you believe it? That I didn't get along with the wrestlers? <clears throat> we had like this theory, me and my friends, it was like, okay, does being conservative make you a wrestler, or does wrestling make you more likely to be conservative? It was like a chicken or the egg type of thing. Um, I like the wrestlers for other reasons. <laughs> Uh, the thing with the wrestlers is that, like, not not to stereotype, but, like, I feel like they didn't have any necks. Like, they just didn't have a neck. And that was kind of the, uh, the point of, um, ridicule a lot for them. Um, the no-neck wrestlers. <laughs> that was just, like, a common thing with them. I don't know why. They were just kind of, like, head on torso. Um, better no-neck than no chin. Um, if I had to pick... I think I'd rather have a neck. Um, I mean, obviously they had a neck, but they were just like very, very small, stumpy necks. <laughs> Some of us are into that. All right, listen, I don't know. I'm not gonna yuck yums, um, except for all the times where I totally do. Bah, bah. So what, no neck? <clears throat> um, oh yeah, the wrestlers love to like carry around their big water jugs all the time. Um, like entire gallons of water. Just lugging it around to class. It's like, alright, I get it, you're hydrated. Wait, I can just leave this. I love that the option is to just leave. Just be a huge coward. Oh, leave twice for good measure. Yeah, exactly. I'm a big giraffe guy, so the longer the neck, the, the more natural ally they make. To the Black Pearl, let's go. <clears throat> skip skip is that like an actual cutscene is that like in theater mode this I bet it's not oh no because it's a uh, text bubble there you go just curious for wayfinder purposes <clears throat> oh yeah all the time splash um and back when that happened, when I was going to school, it wasn't, like, an actual cause for concern. Nowadays, I'd be, like, ducking under the fucking tables. Um, yes, Mega Turtle. Um, you can go to... Um, I believe there's a link beneath the stream that says submit a quiz or submit a book it. Um, I'm sure someone here could get the link for you as well. But it's, uh, should be here. Also that, yeah, regularpat.com, there's a button there if you can't find it underneath the stream. Pat, but I don't... Um, someone submitted me, um, a Kingdom Hearts Bechtel test trivia, but the link doesn't work. And they never got back to me, which is a shame because I would have liked to play that. Um, oops. I gotta go through all the, uh, look at submissions. I feel like there's at least ten in there that I haven't seen yet. Oop. Um, does it ever pass? I feel like Vodka had some questions and other blookets that revealed that it does pass, but not very often. <clears throat> like, I feel like... Does KH1 pass? Probably not. Um, yeah, it's true. The Bechtel test <laughs> failed to be, uh, to be testable. The Bechtel test test. Um, Disney Mania blooket? What is Disney Mania exactly? That sounds familiar, but... Remember Disney Quest? Oh man, it was so cool. This big fucking dumb block in uh, Orlando, you just go in and play video games. There's like no clocks or windows, it's like a casino for kids. Huh. Remember Kingdom Hearts? Oh yeah, I remember. Alright, come on. Um, covers of Disney songs by singers? Oh, okay. Oh, sure, yeah. Do it. We can do, like, a... Like a Kids Bop quiz. <laughs> like the, uh, Jax Films thing. Um, is it Ila Duerta now? Oh, JK. Oh, it's <laughs> literally Circles. Port Royal. Dumbass. <clears throat> um, is there a lot of shared territory between KH and Digimon in terms of voice actors? I feel like I've seen that come up in voice actor trivia, but is it like enough for a whole quiz? Um, 
No, you would want to go to the thing I was just saying. You want to do uh, beneath the drum, the stream. There's a link for um, submitting quizzes. Um, or regularpat.com. There's a button there as well. <laughs> Fucking Will and Elizabeth with their soap opera. Ba -ba -da -ba 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 -da -da. All right, protect the medallion. <sighs> this is gonna be annoying. Maybe you'll drive. This is not the one with the medallion, but they've all gotta die, so. Some can't wait to die! Boom. Gimme. No, my gold piece! You motherfucker. Mm. Come out of the shadows. Out of the shadows, bosun. Boom. No, don't cannon bomb. I feel like I say this every time, but I have no idea what the cannon bomb RC does. If it, like, disrupts. I don't know what it would do. You're just shooting a ship that has nothing to do with this fight. But I don't know. What's up, Carl? I can press the button because my hands are free. And look at that, it didn't break the stream. Can we slow down the pirate spawns? Um, maybe. Anybody know for sure? Like, you'd think there'd be like a big cage 2 brain, and it'd be like, um, actually... I'm gonna cure... I got. I still have it on fucking square. Not that it really matters when I'm playing with my feet. There we go. I have the medallion, right? Oh, God. Um, um, actually, it plays an animation of Sora firing the cannon. You're right, how could I be so blind? Oh, the medallion was stolen. Could you please come over here? I don't know why I said that like Uncle Jesse. Could you please come over here, huh? Not the hair, huh? Uncle Jesse was a fucking loser. <laughs> he was a freeloader. <clears throat> He was like the epitome of 80s coolness, but you look back at it and you're like, okay. That guy kind of sucks. Um, I did. I'm John Stamos. <laughs> I'm Moonlight as Uncle Jesse in Full House. It's not listed in the wiki? Nobody knows? Yeah, I do think Uncle Jesse is big, uh, peak in high school energy. Um, how many pirates are left? Ugh. <laughs> 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 Is that canon? Jesse Katsopoulos dropped out of high school? Or are we talking John Stamos? Or is he method acting and it's both? <sighs> Finally! Jesse and the Rippers. My favorite band. He beat the pirates! Beat the pirates. Did you know? Fuck. There. Okay. Ooh, it's a rowdy rumble! Great. Ooh, did I... Did I die in this yet? I know I failed, but have I died? I don't think I have. I think I'm still perfect game. Uh, maybe I died during the peak fight, actually? If anybody knows, let me know. Because I don't have a death counter up yet. Oh, you know what? Again, that's a fail. But was it a death or was it a foldy arms? Because I folded my arms a ton in Timeless River on the uh, the um, scene of the fire. <clears throat> That's true. Joey was not their uncle. He was just Danny's friend. And he just lived in the little little alcove. Um, which is bizarre. I think there was like a plot line where he, like, he got his own room. But he was a, a puppet ventriloquist freak. 
No, yeah, Joey was just like good friends with Danny from school. Um, Jesse is Danny's brother-in-law. Going big on the Full House lore today. Um, so none of them were blood-related to Danny. This question? Um, which video game boss would be the most inappropriate to put Rowdy Rumble over? My answer is the boss from Metal Gear Solid 3. Yeah, really, probably any Metal Gear boss is probably not super appropriate for Rowdy Rumble. Although I could see, like, MGS1 Revolver Ocelot being uh, pretty fun with Rowdy Rumble. Um, what am I doing? Is it already Barbosa time? <clears throat> um, Giga Bowser in Melee? <laughs> probably not super fitting. Um, Master Xehanor in this. In three, obviously. Once again, Jack. The best Full House sister? Um, I don't know. I always thought Stephanie was the most fun. Because she's like the middle child, so she has the angst. Um, I'm never going to, you know, throw in my lot with uh, the most popular, which is Michelle. Um, <clears throat> Oh, Kimmy? Yeah. If you're gonna count Kimmy in the group, then she's pretty fun. If Full House ran for 192 episodes, they never once visited their mother's grave. That is actually kind of surprising, considering, like, how central the lack of of their mom is to the earlier episodes. That they never once, like, on a Mother's Day special. <clears throat> Um, but I was definitely more of a of a how rude than a you got it, dude. And did DJ even have a catchphrase? Didn't one of them say "Oh my Lanta"? Was that DJ's? Are there are there people in chat who have no idea what the fuck we're talking about, by the way? Because I grew up on Full House on a uh, Nick at Night. Yeah, I think I think Stephanie was also on my land. Why didn't DJ get a catchphrase? That's possible, Esper. Um, and Joey's was cut it out. Did Danny have one besides just being like a clean freak? Stop them! Should I just go? That was dumb. I should not have gone with Wisdom. Not with my feet. Because this whole playthrough is already bankrupt of Wisdom. Um, yeah, I would watch both Fresh Prince and Full House on the same night very often. Very different shows. <clears throat> Mostly because Full House is just kind of nice and Fresh Prince was funny. That was the main, uh, main difference. Hillary Banks. <laughs> Hillary Banks is an icon. That is true. <clears throat> bam, 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 bam. Remember when they replaced Aunt Viv with a different woman? Bam, bam, bam. Where is the Illuminator? Yeah, Nanny and George Lopez also got a lot of play on Nick at Night. Nick and Knight's underrated. <clears throat> That's is that even still a thing? Like I have no idea. I have not like turned on Nickelodeon on the television in potentially eight, nine years. What's up, Vodka? God, I feel like I haven't seen this RC in forever. Oh come on, you're almost done. Oh fuck. We do not. Um, but we've almost cleared Port Royal, so... No! Let's just heal. Alright. Easy peasy. Oh. Zero deaths and seven upset Soras. We'll take it. Only seven? I feel like I failed like a million times on the uh, the mad rides or the uh, the hot rods. Bump 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 bump. Fuck you. Now what? Should we do Agrippa or Halloween Town? Um. Oh, thank you, Opal. I can't edit with other people talking. It drive me nuts. But 
Go off. Go off, King. Oogie Gift? I mean, that'll be harder, though. That's a harder or a higher uh, battle level. Should I get... Let's just get the... Uh, let's get the gummy routes out of the way. We'll just do both in a row. Be a good break. Which golden girl are you? Um, Vaka, can you run a golden girl poll? Or Carly? <clears throat> What's up, Punkit? Um, I never watched the Golden Girls, so... Wait, Nick at Night is only three shows? <laughs> what what shows are they? Yeah, sadly, I can't even name the Golden Girls. Sorry. Oh, quick. Alright, thankfully I can, because I'm using my feet. Alright, this is NickAtNight.com. Featured shows, Friends, Mike and Molly, and Mom. How the Mighty Have Fallen. That's it? Are you sure? That just says featured shows. Surely there's more than that. Alright. So Friends at 9. Oh my god. It's just Friends all night. I, I shit you not. Okay, so the cartoon programming ends at 9. Which is when Friends starts. And then Friends keeps airing until 2.30 in the morning. And then you get... You get four episodes of Mom. And then at 4.42 a.m. you get some Mike and Molly. Until 6.30 when Spongebob comes back on. Which is so random. You get half an hour of Spongebob. And then it's Paw Patrol. For an hour and a half. And they slot in some Peppa Pig for half an hour some Gabby's Dollhouse, back to Paw Patrol. What the fuck is, is television scheduling? I don't understand this at all. Um, but yeah, three shows on Nick at Night, and it's mostly just friends. <clears throat> yeah, four episodes of the Master of Masters. Um, wow. So where do you even go to watch, like... Probably gotta stream it now, right? Like, if you want to watch Full House or Fresh Prince or... Any of the other things we just named? Oh, 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 oh! Is that a death? <laughs> I don't know if that's a death. I don't see Sora's heart there. I can't believe it. Life is such a funny journey. <sighs> oh yeah, TV Land. I forgot about that. Um, I don't think it is. I think I didn't see Sora's dead body. I gotta see the body. No, we don't know if he pressed the eject button on the on the uh, the pilot chair. You wouldn't be able to see, you know, because the screen goes white too fast. Um, he totally can live in space. He totally can. You got fucking TVA out in deep space. I mean, I guess they're using their armor when they're in the exterior portions. I think he can. I think if Sora can defeat the world of chaos, I think he can survive outer space. So we're gonna say no death still. Yeah, one one crumbly gummy ship. Well, it's like it's tough to stay in the middle of those explodey bubbles at the end here. Yeah, I think you can see most of Old School Nick on Paramount Plus. Um, there's probably some exceptions, but I feel like anything that's like an official Nick tune, that's probably on Paramount Plus, right? Which means I should binge Hey Arnold. Which is an objective top five Nicktoon. Um, are you a big ginger person, Carly? The thing about As Told by Ginger is that the characters' faces were always so gross to me. I hated their faces. <laughs> they were just like these... I don't know what it was about them. They were the same animators as Rugrats, but the Rugrats characters never bothered me. The ginger characters, I was just like, ugh. Something about their proportions. Objective top five Nicktoons. So, hey Arnold, I think you gotta have a Spongebob in there. Um, I think probably Rugrats. And then two more spots. Man, I don't know. Can you throw out some options for me? I'm having trouble thinking of them. I'm gonna die on this again. I don't know how I get past this. Catalog I like and I think is good, but I don't know if it's like top five. Um, 
Also, I really like Rocco. Oh, I guess, is Avatar, does that count as a Nicktoon? I guess it does. Yeah, you gotta put Avatar in there. Um, see, Fairly On Parents, I feel like, really took a dip, though. I guess Spongebob also did, but I feel like Spongebob is strong enough to just stand on the first three seasons. Um, my ship died, though, not Sora. We're counting Sora deaths. Definitely not Doug. Um, because <clears throat> who cares? I watched Doug, but I did not care about it. Um, I don't think Angry Beavers... What about Jimmy Neutron? I feel like that's low-key underrated. Um, or maybe even Danny Phantom. I don't think real monsters, no. Yeah, Doug, uh, Doug is a traitor. Why does it look like Disney? I feel like as a kid I didn't appreciate Jimmy Neutron, and uh, nowadays when I see clips of it, I'm like, oh yeah, that's pretty good. You hate Carl? You hate Sheen? I get hating Jimmy. Jimmy sucks. Jimmy's the worst part of Jimmy Neutron. Um, which is rare that I feel like the main character is the absolute worst, but... How could you hate Carl? <laughs> what? See, I knew you'd like Cindy. <clears throat> I think Vodka's talk is that. Um... Meow. <laughs> Um, the really neat thing about Jimmy Neutron is that you could tell what season it was by how Libby looked, and that was like a really useful indicator of whether or not you wanted to watch the episode. Because you'd be like, alright, Libby's in her old attire, that means that I've probably seen this episode a million times. But then when they changed her her look when she went to Egypt, when they, uh, what was the Pharaoh, Queen, how's about a Sloppia? That's, that's the, uh, the turning point for the series. <clears throat> She had the green dress and then she had like the purple sweater. Alright, just stay in the middle. Just stay in the middle! Fuck! I don't know how I get past this. And unfortunately, we have to do Agrabah. Um, maybe I have to change my gummy ship. I mean, maybe just go high when level 5? Which one of these fucking symbols down here? Is it a shield? That's got 274. Sorry, Claw, but I need to... I need to live. Um, honestly, so to, to finalize the list, because I do have a lot of nostalgia for Rocco, and I think Rocco is also just pretty good. So I'm gonna go Spongebob, Rugrats, Rocco, Hey Arnold, and... That fifth one is tough. Mm. Oh, Avatar. Yeah. <sighs> Which, can I get like a... Uh... I remember last time we discussed the uh, live-action Avatar, we were playing Cage 2. I think I was fighting the Zemus 1. Maybe in Nobody May Cry. Um, anyone watch the live-action one? Like, what's the consensus? I feel like it's mostly bad but I'm willing to hear other people's takes on it. Uh, top five characters that give Larkzy and WHM energy. Oh, Elena from Rebirth, actually. It's basically just Larkzy again. Um, yeah, Cindy Vortex. Um, I feel like probably Shigo from Kim Possible, even though I never really watched that. I feel like she fits. Um... My brain's empty. Courtney and Miranda from As Told by Ginger. Yeah, I could see that. Oh, Sharpay, of course. Sylvia, No More Heroes. I could see that. We're talking about big WHM characters. Wasn't it so random from Disney? Wasn't that like the Demi Lovato spinoff show? Bam, 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 bam. She's really good. <laughs> God, I love that. That dorky girl playing the keyboard in Demi Lovato is like, she's really good. Maybe I should just like spin over and over during this. Mash circle instead for dodge roll. WHM is Women's History Month. It's uh, it's a long story. Oh. 
Just spin. Just spin through it. Yeah. There you go. I probably could have survived with Club. I thought to just spin through it. I still gotta make it through another round of this. Fuck. No, no, no. Oh my god. I don't know how we do it, folks. I have no idea how we do this. And what sucks is I have to play all the way up to, to that part. Any ideas? Uh, I could just move on to Halloween Town for now, I guess. Fuck. I didn't expect the gummy route to be a, a roadblock, but I lack the dexterity necessary to make it through that. Oh, true. Maybe I can get a better blueprint with the with this one. Sorry I've been doing gummy ships for like 20 minutes. Uh, what a world. I guess they're gonna ban uh, TikTok tomorrow. I'm glad I didn't get super invested in my, uh, my TikTok account. <laughs> I posted three and then I kind of forgot about it. <clears throat> Well, we're going to vote on it, but the way things go, I feel like they're probably going to ban it, right? Oh, it's the third time? Okay, maybe not then. I don't know. <clears throat> yeah, the True Jackson VP. Oh, uh, um, I never watched the show, but the theme song is really catchy. Um... I feel like the network didn't give that show a ton of love when it was on. Yeah, I know Drake Bell is, is problematic, but Drake and Josh does hold up. It's still pretty good, I think. I rewatched it maybe like three years ago. Kiki Palmer's wearing my jeans. <laughs> Classic. Bow. Didn't he go to Mexico? Drake Bell? Okay, I'm curious to see if Zoe 101 holds up, because I feel like even when that was airing, I was like, what? this show sucks. <laughs> I never got Zoe 101. Like, I probably watched every episode, but I was like, what is the point of this? Like, everyone's so annoying. Zoe's annoying. Chase is annoying. You know? I don't know. Fake college. I guess that's the point. I don't know, man. I think of the of the Schneider shows, at least of the ones that came out while I was a kid, that is the weakest one. <clears throat> um, yeah, true. I guess the whole premise is the uh, Zoe Chase will they won't they. Well, initially the premise was this used to be an all boys school. We're gonna put. We're gonna put fairy dust in the in the urinals. We're gonna decorate them. Of ranking the Ned's tips, yeah. I do want to rank the Ned's tips. I think honestly, Ned's clears any Schneider show. Um, I think it's actually, I think Ned's is funnier than Drake and Josh. But they're both. I think they're top two. Um, because Ned's had heart as well. And it had practicality. Some of those tips were good tips. Alright, we survived this route, barely. Bum, bum, ba -dum, ba -dum, bum. Ooh, um, Vodka, Missy from uh, Ned's. She has Larkseen energy. She was like a kind of side character. She was like the blonde, ditzy girl. Bum, ba -dum, bum. And like Ned had the privilege of dating her. Bum, 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 bum. All right. Speaking of all these shows, there's like this this surge of uh, of podcasts from people who were on the shows talking about them. Like the Ned's trio has their own podcast where they talk about the show. And I saw, I think it was on my YouTube recommended sidebar. Fucking Dave Coulier is doing a Full House one. <coughs> oh yeah, the Wizards one, but it's like it's like um. Selena Gomez's friend on the show and the dad. It's like a really weird combo of two like very secondary characters. Um, I feel like you gotta have at least one of the siblings on there. But it's the dad and the best friend. 
Bow, bow, bow. Oh yeah, like, they're always spilling, uh, I watched or listened to, like, the first three episodes of the Ned's, um, podcast. But yeah, there's, I always see clips and, like, tweets about, like, Ned and, uh, Mosley talking about their, their canoodling. Um, or just, like, their romantic history with each other. That seems to be a focal point of it. Ooh, we gotta do Prison Keeper and Oogie in this visit. <clears throat> Let's ignore the fight and get Trej. Yeah, and poor Cookie's just sitting there like, okay. Alright. Oh, Evelyn Kwan. <laughs> Um, Cookie's, uh, th was that, was Cookie and Evelyn, was that Endgame? Who ended up with who at the end of, uh, at the end of Ned's? Because it was Ned and Moe's by the end of it, right? It was Cookie and Lisa's emo? I thought they were kind of, like, on and off again. <clears throat> there was Lisa and Cookie. And then did Susie Crabgrass end up with the bully? No, Cookie and the uh, Siberian Husky. Okay, yeah. Uh, Billy Loomer. Um, did Coconut Head? <laughs> did he get anybody at the end? Probably not. <clears throat> Loomer and Susie were so endgame goaded all along. The bully and the most popular girl in school. Coconut Head deserves no one. There should have been. He should have gotten a haircut in the last episode. That would have been good. See, that was a, a sitcom where it actually had an ending. I guess most of the Nick ones did, though, didn't they? Did Drake and Josh have a proper ending? Like, they have the Christmas special. But I don't remember... Was the Hollywood episode supposed to be their ending? Is that the, like, actual finale? The Hollywood one? And then Zoe 101... I remember Zoe and Chase, like... being together at the end. Didn't, like, Chase's grandma die or something? And they were, like... I don't know if that was the finale or not, but they were, like, at a dance or a party or something. Maybe that was, like, before they graduated? The videotape was, like, a season one thing where, like, Chase confessed his feelings, but then the tape got... Or no, it was like Zoe said something about Chase. I don't know. And Zoe's tape, he like tried to get Zoe's tape. Back when taping things was a thing. Um, it did, Esper. Yeah, Zoe 102. It's probably on Paramount right now. I've been saying that I wanted to watch it with like Keynote and the boys as a joke, but it's never uh never materialized. <clears throat> yeah, yeah, that was a that was like a time capsule thing with the tape. You can dig it up in like twenty years. Or ten years or something. <laughs> um, and I Carly had an ending, right? Carly fucked off to uh, Italy, right? And Sam rode off to be on Sam and Cat. But I feel like Victorious didn't have a real ending. I don't know. I'm just at this point, I'm extrapolating off of the Quentin reviews videos. <laughs> I don't remember him saying that Victorious had a real ending. I feel like it just got cancelled. And then Sam and Cop also did not, because that show was doomed from the start. <laughs> Sorry, I just disassociated. Um, I remember... Um, like, Sam and Cat still feels like a very new show, but I guess it's like 10 years old at this point, which is upsetting. Because I remember, like, Ariana Grande, like, just, like, coming onto the scene. Because it was... I was watching Big Brother 16, which would have been the summer of... 2014? Maybe? I think? Um, and her brother was on that season. And it was, like, a big deal that he was her brother, but no one really cared like in the house because nobody knew who Ariana Grande was yet. Um, I think like two people were like, oh cool, but most of them were like, Ariana Grande, like who's Ariana Grande? Nobody had any idea. 
Um, so that's a bit of a time capsule. Ba ba ba. <clears throat> BB-16, uh, I credit it with ruining the show for like 10 years. <laughs> I feel like the last couple of seasons we've gotten out of the rut, but I feel like... I mean, 17 was good, but like 18 through pretty much 22 kind of is like living in the shadow of the 16 blueprint, which is a shame. Um, you went to Frankie's apartment one time for a BB-15 watch party. He's mean. <laughs> That's so funny. That makes a lot of sense. Like, I'm not surprised. I'm not surprised that you managed to find your way at a BB-15 Frankie Grande uh, watch party, and also that Frankie Grande was mean. Um, that's very funny. Was that in LA, Splash, or was that in New York? I don't remember where Frankie is based out of. I haven't saved in a while. New York, yeah. Alright, because he was on Broadway and stuff, right? <clears throat> So what is it now? Is it, uh, back to the lab and then Prison Keeper? I guess I should try to open more chests. You know what I need to do? I need a menu. I need to look at my abilities, look at my shortcuts. Again, not that it really matters what button Kira is on, because it's always going to be cumbersome to press. Back to the lab again. Let's do that. Oh, come on. Press pause. Press pause. Pause, please. Come on. There we go. Um, all right, customize Sora. Let's put Kira on X. Probably just Kira on. Keep it on Square as well. Panic button. Um, and then abilities. Oh god, I have a lot of AP. Um, no, nope, can't go wrong with a little high jump. Oh wait, I can press triangle on these. Yeah, that's Splash's favorite. Come on. Okay, um, probably can't go wrong with combo boost or reaction. Oh, wow, that costs a lot. Well, maybe I'll use my AP ups. Hopefully I have at least a couple. Oh, wow. Okay. Let's not accidentally use them on the party members. Okay. Go back to abilities. Um, let's see. I feel like getting more damage out of RCs, although am I gonna use RCs a ton because I have to move my my big toe to triangle? Uh maybe oh, god damn it. Definitely no square moves. Um maybe aerial dive. Triangle please, triangle. Yeah, let's just go for these. I don't know. Maybe Auto Valor is like a panic button as well. Alright. It'd be great if I had like a movement ability so I could go through these rooms faster, but I'm not gonna be grinding my forms. Ugh, my chair keeps moving. It's very annoying. Oh. <clears throat> um, anyway. I've been doing my new game plus on Persona, which is crazy because, like, Rebirth is out and I can play it whenever I want, but I probably spent more time playing Persona 4 because I want to get all the achievements and the extra content that I missed out on the first time through. Um, having a lot of fun with that. Are we talking to... Wait, is it not the lab? God damn it. Are we going back to the Curly Hill? Oh, yeah. Can we do that? Can we vote? Yes, yeah, Sparty. I beat Persona 4, and I'm playing New Game Plus now. Um, and I love it. And I don't think I like it as a game more than 5, but I do like the characters more. Um, and I watched the anime. I watched all the anime, um, and it was really good. And I'm, uh, I'm like overloaded on Persona content. <clears throat> anyway, can we run a poll, Vodka? Um, which uh, bracket we should run on Thursday? So that's what we're gonna do. Um, let me pull up our options. We have... Okay, so what we're gonna do is Kiwi is not gonna be here on 
um, this Thursday, but I think I can get him for next Thursday. And I think the one I want to do with him is the trio bracket. So we're going to say trio bracket for next Thursday. But for this Thursday, we have the Keyblade bracket. We have... We can't do Sound Drop. I don't have enough time to get that together. Um, so Keyblades. Um, and then, Vok, what do you have? The, the Outfit bracket and the Hair bracket? So those are the options. Those three. Keyblade, Outfit, Hair. Um, and then you can vote. No, I don't want Wisdom. Ugh. No, I don't want Chicken Little. I want to go Valor. Or possibly Anti. That could happen. Thankfully not. <clears throat> Ooh. Vaka, do you have, like, images attached to all of the... to the characters in the bracket? Because I'll probably have to do that so we can actually have a, a visual... Well, I mean, that'd be useful. It'd be helpful to me. <laughs> I guess I'll have to do it. I'll have to do it sometime tonight or tomorrow. <clears throat> um, the outfit bracket is called I hate you for not making an empty bracket. You told me that it was fine if I just sent you the gorilla's one. I apologize, but that's you said it was okay. No, that's alright. I'll, uh, I'll link images to... Uh, I guess if we... I'll have to link images to any of the brackets, because we want to be able to see what they look like. Uh, you do, Quinn. That's actually a strat they use in the rando to get, uh, easy points for Valor. <clears throat> Alright. Here, please. Together is the key. the big fish of Cage, too, this guy. Hey, welcome to the Discord, Vlad. Thanks for joining up. Sorry to anyone who's annoyed when I ping everyone for a stream, but you can turn it off if, uh, if you don't like it. Okay, we have a fucking three-way tie. Um, Keyblade, outfit, or hair. Um, I guess... Uh, God, what do we do? Is there a distinction between Big Fish and Big Fish? Not really. I use them interchangeably. So there's Big Fish in KH3 and then Big Fish in Ape Escape 1. Um, I don't know what we do. I guess rerun it, yeah. Because I don't really have a preference either way which one we do first. We were probably going to do all of them. Um, although, actually... Well, the trio is going to be next week. Let me look at my calendar here. So if trios is the 21st, then I guess we'd only have time for one more if we're going to be in bracket season. But we can always just save some for next year, you know? <sighs> yeah. If we do trios on the 21st, one of these three on the 14th, then that means we have one left for the 28th. And that's either going to be Sound Drops or one of the two not selected here. So, I'm not sure. Okay, why are we manipulating the poll? I don't like that. <laughs> why are we using points to manipulate? Okay, too bad, whatever. <laughs> Fine, manipulate using your points on what the bracket should be. <clears throat> That just means the richer people get to determine what happens, just like real life. This is supposed to be escapist, you know? Okay, now is it back to the lab? Yeah, pay to win. It wasn't my choice, it was Vaka's. What the fuck? <laughs> is it just back to the... Oh, god damn it! I've wasted so much time just walking around hallway town. Mmm... starting to feel strenuous as well. I've only been through a world and a half. And a lot of gummy ship. What's up? Uh, God, is that... When is that? Thursday? <laughs> I don't think so, Jip. Um, I guess I'll wear green. 
Is it Thursday or is that... I always forget what day is on. No, it's the 17th, right? I don't know, my own damn day. Yeah. <clears throat> is 17th a stream day? Um, if it's Sunday, then no. But I know my Aunt Lisa will send me $20 in the mail because my name's Patrick, and that's just luck of the draw, baby. Excited for that. Uh, stream schedule is typically Tuesday, Thursdays at 6, Saturdays at 4. Oh, thanks, Vaka. <laughs> um, but the Saturday is usually subject to change. Um, this weekend it'll be normal. I think next weekend it probably won't be. <clears throat> is it worth getting a PS5 for? Um, if you really enjoyed Remake, probably. Um, definitely don't get it if you haven't played Remake. Ooh, costumes won the poll. Okay, we're doing cage outfit bracket. The drip bracket. What should we call it? Like, what should be the official name? I need help with the branding. Who's my guest on that? I mean, I don't have anyone planned. I don't need to have a guest. It could just be me in the chat, but... Um... I don't know. Any ideas? There's only so many people who I feel like are comfortable enough to, you know, be stuck on a stream with me for three hours. So, I do have impeccable taste, that's true. So, it could just be me, myself, and I. <clears throat> Alright, Ogie. I'm not sure if this will be difficult on feet percent, but we'll see. That's right, away you go! Alright, I gotta switch over triangle for these. Okay, doing a bad job so far. Um, could you hit triangle? Fat fucking toe? Ugh. My thighs hurt. Fuck. Why aren't you hitting it? Sorry, I was talking about my own big toe. I would never call Ogie a big fat toe. Fucking... Oh god. Alright, get over here, you sack of shit. That is towards Ogie. Oh man, what is, what is Ogie? Like, three cycles? I think it's all characters, right? 128 characters? <laughs> I expected this to be a 64 bracket. Don't ask about how it was seated? Okay. So, I guess tonight I'll be going to the KH wiki and linking images to these so we can actually see what they look like. I know most of us probably know off the top of our heads, but I think having a visual component there will be useful. <laughs> Listen, it's a visual bracket. We need visuals. So I'll do it, it's fine. <clears throat> or maybe I can find an intern to do it. My least favorite member of the organization, Lexius. Lexius pretty easily, there's not a ton going on there. But I'm not a huge Zaldin guy. <laughs> any uh, any regular pat interns want to, uh, want to take the vodka bracket and link images to it? No, no, don't go in yet, now go in. <clears throat> what does it matter, Baka? You just fucking control A and delete all. Come on, surely, surely there's an intern who wants to do it. Unpaid image linking work. Really? Because that's, that's what I did. I take my bracket and I just delete it all. I'm going to make a new one. Make a copy, delete all. Kept the formulas? Um, I think if you just delete all the plain text, it should be fine. Like, not, uh, I don't know. I feel like I remember doing that, so I could be wrong. Alright, fine, I'll do it. I'll link the 128 images. Yeah, you get paid an exposure. I'll say, Snarling Apollo did such a great job. I'm getting really lucky with these portals. Come on, Ugg. Give me a break. 
Sora just fucking fucking I'm hitting triangle maybe I'm not maybe I'm hitting square I gotta heal oh god well I got leaf razor Focus, focus. This is just a battle of endurance. Fuck off! Oh, my friends are dead. Alright, and... No, oh, come on, be blue. There you go. Um, can I be an Amish man in a fight? Definitely not. They're probably ripped, working on the farm all day, churning butter. I'm churning content, which takes... Um... Way less calories, so. Oh. I'm not gonna fuck with an Amish guy, are you kidding me? You no jip, but I wish I was. I do get into a yearly Minecraft phase. I think once regular GF and I live together and she has a proper computer, um, I'll be back in the Minecraft phase. <clears throat> because uh, playing uh, cross-platform me on desktop or on Switch, that's not as fun. <clears throat> um, we did have a, a Minecraft world for a bit there, and a Stardew Valley farm. Which, ooh, isn't that isn't that this month? When Stardew Valley update? Oh man, that's like within a couple of days, is it not? Ooh. I feel like it's like 18th, 19th. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh no. Please cure. Jesus Christ. I was so close to having to do this all over again. Come on, hit it. How fucking many more? Thank you. Oh my god, fuck off. Please don't retreat. Oh my god. Cage you, don't cage to me. Thank god. I actually don't know if he can go back up if you take too long. I would assume he can. Oh, god. What a workout. <laughs> For my right thigh. Ugh. My thoughts exactly, ugh. Okay, I got Magnet. Um, problem is, I still have to do Agrabah, and I gotta get through that fucking ancient highway. I mean, do I have to go to Pride Lands? Oh, wait. Do I not need to go to Agrabah? <laughs> I do eventually, but not right now. And I can go do Finny Fun. Wanna do uh, Party of Worlds? I just said I don't have to do Pride Lands. I'm gonna go do Finny Fun right now. Fuck that. Fuck that. <laughs> let's go. Let's go fight the Berserkers. So I can I can put off Ancient Highway until the second visits, but I do have to do it at some point. Um, if if we talk over it enough, it doesn't have to be muted. But yeah, maybe just to be safe, I should mute it though. <clears throat> I mean, the only reason to do Finny Fun would be to get Thunder, which I don't necessarily need. I'm not really using magic a ton. Going all physicals, you know? Am I under-leveled, by the way? I don't really know what level I'm supposed to be at by mid-game. Um, but yeah, I'm, I'm hyped for Stardew Valley, whatever it is, one point, was it 1.6 or 16? I don't know. A lot of cool stuff. Big chest, you can put all your items in a bigger chest now. Um, winter events, winter outfits. 1.6, there you go. Um, new endgame stuff. Ooh. 
which I never even got through all the end game of the current version of the game, but more stuff the merrier. But when's Haunted Chocolatier, though? You know? That's what I really want. Um, also, related, I could probably mentioned this on stream, but the Stardew Valley board game is actually really fun. I got that um, a couple months ago. I played that a few times with regular GF and uh, my sister and her boyfriend. Oh, thanks, Donald. I was just about to do that. He's a good boy. I'm just gonna get slap chopped. I'll just sit here and yeah. Yeah, it's like um, it's a cooperative game. So depending on how many players you have, the more like community bundle things you have to do. Um, but you have to like kind of like talk out your plans with each other and make a plan for each day. Everyone has like a different role. You can like get a tool, like a pickaxe or a watering can or a fishing rod. Oh, come on, come on! Should probably turn on Leaf Bracer. <clears throat> Hi, it's Berserk with Slap Chop. You're gonna love my nuts. <laughs> that's last time. Oh yeah, that's why. <laughs> That's why I thought of it again, because last time we talked about Slap Chop, we were fighting Berserkers and Nobody May Cry. And I got to use my hands for that. Simpler times. Okay. Well, that's dealt with. Impressive. Um, what's up, Sykes? Should we watch this cutscene? Get myself a break? <sighs> yeah, Berserkers, that's a wild way to spell that word. I expect he's here um, well, Barty, when I play with what my I hands, care. I don't feel physical see, pain in my Axel's arms, no so that's kind of a neat bonus interest. to uh, playing Is with my hands. Is he with the organization, too? Yes. You have a front? Not a my right thigh right now is very eepy. Don't let your guard down. Yeah, let's Axel at least see the hair flip. Stop at nothing to turn Wait, does he take hardness. his hood off in this scene? He does, right? Yeah. Gee, thanks for looking out for us, mister. <laughs> but I'm sure we can take care of ourselves just fine. Glad to hear it. Axel aside, what an asshole. It would break our hearts to hear something happen. What's up, Rune Mancer? Hearts? You don't have any hearts. True, we don't have hearts. But, but we have fabulous hair. We remember hair. what it was like. That's what makes us. Special. That's a weird time to take your hood off, so right? After Donald Duck we like gives you the business. Well. How to injure like, now is the time to show my pretty face. Sora, my sick scar. You just keep on fighting those hot. Oh man, that'd be awesome, Buffoon. <laughs> then you could edit I'm the hair, sure. be any but org member you want. he'll lead us to the organization's world. Well, probably not, Don't right? I feel reckless. like the me hair is not that. Uh, end up like Riku? Not that customizable. What? <laughs> He's so dramatic. Like, what even is that? What does that do for anybody? Wait. To walk backwards with the arms out, you know. What did he mean? Fuck off, Sykes. Like Riku. Fucking loser. All right, we got Cypher's trophy. We gotta go to the station. Which wait, this is the wrong way. It's quicker to go this way. I'm skating. <clears throat> I was gonna say skating with my feet, but I guess that's kind of not that impressive. This should help. Come on. Oh, Mega Turtle. Thank you for gifting a sub to Joshua Aurelius for Mega Turtle's first gift sub. Thank you so much. You're right, that's Roxas's trophy. But Cypher in the real world is reclaiming it, I guess. This is Data Roxas. No, real Roxas, but Data Trophy. Hard to parse all that out. Okay, there we go. Let me get Oath Keeper and Limit Form. Maybe we should switch over to that. Oh god, how much more can I bear? Um, bow, bow, bow. Don't be sad. like Jimmy Neutron. Oh, right, you know. <laughs> so it's all my fault. Uh, I didn't mean. You mm. Thanks, guys. Oh no! I mean, I could. You're we right can make our way to Space Paranoids. Yeah. I'm still concerned about Agraba if that's going to be the wall for the, the whole playthrough. 
I think we'll try to do space paranoids at least. See if I can make my way through that. It's Cloud! He's sad because he doesn't have a PS5. He's just standing there. Sorry, you can't play your own game, Cloud. Yeah, Agrabah might be unsavable. That might be the case. What is Cloud doing? Beats the shit out of me. What do I look like? It's fucking babysitter? Oh god, why did I try to use the camera? Oh man. Oh. How about it, Sid? Oh! God damn it. Bow, bow. You know what? Leaf Bracer needs to go on right now. What the fuck is Cloud doing? Uh, where is that? No. Why does it only cost one? That's crazy. It's such a good ability. What a steal. Okay. <clears throat> ba -ba -ba. I'm playing Ever Crisis. Oh. Yeah, man. Yeah, man. There's some Cage 2 platforming for you. Bit of a time save. Bit of a foot calorie save. Oh. Hey, should we talk about what I'm doing on Saturdays after Sonic Adventure 1? What do the people want? I was thinking Sly 4. Although, we could have a holdover week and do Pajama Sam 3. <clears throat> Sly! Double crossing. There you go. Sonic Adventure 1 again? Uh, I don't want to fly that high. <clears throat> I don't think so. Yeah, I think I gotta buy Sly 4 though. Um, what would be the best way for me to do that? Ba -ba -ba -ba. What platforms is that on? Spore. <laughs> Back to Spore for the Spore Whores. Ba -ba -ba -ba. I think you'll be alright, T Mac. There's not too much. If you already know the Bentley voice, there's not a ton of lore that I develop uh, in 2 and 3. Ooh, yeah. Pajama Sam 3 is going to be Thanksgiving week. Yeah. <laughs> Although Thanksgiving is many, many months away. <clears throat> but I did want to do that. Persona 5 Strikers is just a Sly game? I don't think that's true, right? I've played the first three Sly games in the first hour of Persona 5 Strikers. I don't feel like they're the same genre. Sly 4 is only PS3 and Vita? It's not really super available for me. Um, how easy is it to obtain legitimately? To stream it legitimately? They both have characters? <laughs> I guess you hit things in both of them to a degree. Yeah, can I like buy a port of Sly 4 anywhere? Um, let me look that up right now. Handsome. I guess the backlog would probably say what it's on. Gorge. I guess this must be his room. Master um, King. What the fuck is the game actually called though? Like officially, Hello? it's not Sly Four. Hey you. Sly Cooper Four. Oh, it's just called Sly Cooper Thieves in Time. Um, I'm it's, looking it's for on somebody. Four, have any of you seen a guy with spiky still hair? Still be annoying as I have to hook up my PS4, but. Oh god, that would be that'd be so annoying actually. <laughs> because I'd have to move my PS5 and 4 between each stream. But on a backlog it says Vita 3 and 4. I don't know. Yeah, it's the lady from Rebirth. What's hey. your name? Tifa. Alright, hi Leon. Tofu? Yeah, that's a great question, Barnabas. Like, why... <laughs> you would think that the painting wasn't there before the apprentices overtook everything, but... Yeah, like... 
Why did this... Why was this made? That's a great question. Xehanort's like, finally I'm in charge. My first order of business, I'm gonna get a painting commissioned. It's kind of silly. Isa drew it. <laughs> I can see Isa being like the artsy type. Get some uh, drawing tips from Nominee now that they're both on the same side. Actually, probably Nominee gets some drawing tips from, from Isa. I think Nominee is like way overrated as an artist. That's like my KH hot take. I think she's not very good. I mean, she's good for like, like a two-year-old, you know? But it's just scribbles. Um, oh, it's minimalist, you don't get it. Whatever, I could do the same thing that she does. <laughs> she's not trying. Her full power has not been unleashed. Um, Alright, I'm gonna try to make it through Space Paranoids. I am feeling the burn a bit, the discomfort. But I'd like to at least get through three worlds. Come on! I don't know why I'm bothering to open this. It's a map for the pit cell. Like, why even bother? Yeah, you're right. She's like one or whatever. <clears throat> Scribbles is a good baby name. Like, for a human, Splash. Baby Scribbles. <laughs> Bow. You think Lee's best game is Dream Drop Distance? What are you smoking, Vodka? Vodka's drunk off her own supply. You know? That can't be. That cannot be the case. This will not stand. Dark Rescue is my middle name. No way the game where that man says that is the best Lee game. It's just not possible. Oh, oh, the fucking energy core. You had your perfect little script, but you kind of forgot to write the sequel. Now, let's see what happens. There's just no way. There's no way. <laughs> I mean... If you're gonna say, like, Lee only, then I still think 3 or BBS is better. If you're lumping Axel into it, there's no way. But if it's specifically Lee, I still think it's the worst of the three Lee appearances. And he's only in one scene in BBS. I'm not saying his KH3 appearance is great. You're, you're lumping Axel in and you think the best game for that character overall is Dream Drop Distance. I have no idea which one is the right block. Oh my god. <laughs> I'm goaded. I wasn't aiming for that one, but I got it. I think calm and two, clear, really everything else. <clears throat> um, I mean, he's not in a ton of two, to be honest. Like, he's, you know, beginning, middle, and end, as always. All the good stuff in two. Listen, I don't want to fight with you. I don't have the energy today. Maybe we should do another hot take tournament. Oh. Oh. It's on PS4, but only by using PS now. So yeah, I don't know. I'm really not a fan of like having to uh, switch between my PS4 and 5 every time I stream. Um, but, I mean... We gotta play it at some... Oh, God damn it! We gotta play it at some point. <clears throat> Esper, maybe there's a way to obtain it legitimately. You know? Bam, bam. I mean, I just have to make room. I can. It's just annoying. The PS5 is so fucking big, it's like... <laughs> how do I have anything else next to it? There's no room on my desk. Which means I just have to, like, lug it around all the time. Yeah, maybe we should, you know, play, uh... Wind Waker. Not actually, but, you know, to, uh... We find a better way to play Sly. But, um, maybe if I play Wind Waker, it'll inspire me to find a, a different way to play Sly 4. So, what did you want to bup, 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 bup. I feel like the, uh, hostile program is going to be very annoying. Ugh, my legs are feeling it. Vodka, do you want to run a poll for a Blook It? Because, uh, I'm reaching my my breaking point. Maybe I need to do more leg exercises. Like, it's not, like, searing pain. It's just very annoying, you know? Um, back into space paranoids. Okay. Um, then I will run the pull. Let's see. 
I probably need to get my leg bladder taken out. <laughs> Too much sludge. Alright, let's see what's on the double feature list here. Take a Motrin. What are you, my dad? Anytime something's wrong, just take a Motrin. I remember talking to him about my gallbladder. He's like, eh, take a Motrin. <laughs> it's probably a muscle. Now, now I'm like super paranoid about anything. Because I know it's not just a muscle. Okay, so. We have End of the World Trivia. We have uh, Pac-Man World Trivia. I don't want to do Sly Cooper yet. Because I want to wait until we play for Organization 13 Weapons Themes. Smash Ultimate, who's that character? March Caprice 2023 trivia. MCU trivia. Lick Rush trivia. Union Cross and Dark Road Heartless. Um, we have Saix Weapon trivia. Ali's Joke trivia. Pokemon Emerald trivia. Data Greeting trivia. Maverick Flare and Twilight Blaze trivia. Disney Actor trivia. Rankin Bass Holiday Special trivia. And that's all I have in double features. Um, so let's see. I see some fanfare for, actually, if you want to look at the list yourself, right here. Um, I see some fanfare for jokes and for Organization 13 weapons. Um, March Caprice. What other time will we have for the 2023 March Caprice one? Yeah, but the thing is, like, what is the... I need to know more about what the trivia is on that one. Yeah, Rankin Bass. Um, that was submitted by Dusta Monster. Like, if the March Caprice trivia is like, who did this this entry? Is that going to mean anything to us at this point? That you're out? Wait, like, is anyone going to be able to get it? Oh yeah, Fruitune did that one, so let me know. Um, ranking bass trivia, yeah, that's it. <laughs> We're ranking different fish species. Alright, talk amongst yourselves as to which one sounds the best. I feel like I'm seeing chatter for March Caprice, Org Weapons, and the jokes. Yeah, fuck sea bass. Taking up ocean space and Animal Crossing. Pup, 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 pup. Or 13. Alright, that seems to be like the the one that's getting the most talk. Alright, so let's see if I can make it through um, Space Paranoids. And then we will move on to that. <clears throat> um, very awkwardly, T Mac. I have to kind of like curl my left foot around the controller. It sucks. I kind of forgot that this is heavy on the triggers. Yeah. Oh, I actually kind of like fishing in Animal Crossing. It's not the best, but I find it kind of soothing. Oop! Okay. Well, fuck me. There are better fishing minigames, but that one's simple and nice enough. <sighs> I don't want to do this again, so I'm... Oh, I'm probably going to have to, because I can take one more hit. Oh, God. Fuck! Is that a death? Oh, fuck! Oh. <sighs> That's my first death. The first legit death. What? Are you fucking kidding me? Fuck this. <laughs> Whatever. Why am I back out here? I guess I just have to re enter the computer, right? There's nothing else that I have to do, right? It puts me right in. It feels really far back. Why not just start me off in the pit cell? No, I saved. It doesn't. KH doesn't work that way. <clears throat> okay. I freaked out for no reason there, but it just seemed like <laughs> I had to do a lot more to get back to this. I really didn't. Alright. See, the problem is, I can't just tank all these hits. But I have to have my feet ready to do L1-R1. 
If I can just kind of stay away... Well, I should be able to get my feet back in position in time. You square to bash on these guys. Square button, go burr! Bop, bop. Bop, 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 bop. A prophetic dream, punk it? About me specifically doing this part with my feet? It's a fucked up dream. Sorry about that. Bop, 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 bop. Oh, true, I did... I did, uh... Skip Agrabah and Pride Lands. Mostly because I can't make it through Agrabah. And if I don't have to do Pride Lands, I'm not gonna... Damn it, Sora. Oh my god. R1. Yeah, I think after I beat Light Cycle, we're gonna do Blook It. Fuck. I'm in a good spot now, though, health wise. Fuck you. Fuck you. Oh, that works. Oh, Sora. Damn it. No, no. Oh, God, no. Don't make me do it again. You must live. Oh, balls, balls. Come on. No, R1, R1. Fuck me. Fuck you. Wait. Oh, oh God. Please let it be over. I see it. I see the end hole. No! Oh god. Those things can actually hit you, I don't think. <laughs> Whew. Alright, we did it. Sorry. Um, I'll go back up and look. Um, MC Trivia is in the format of, like, in XYZ's video about out-of-bounds shit, what can be found in ABC World? Which of these songs yeah. received a death metal cover in the Conscious Soiree? Okay. All right, well then let's vote then, because that does seem doable. Seems like the, the main two interests here are Org Weapons and March for Priest. Here? We came to give you the password. Why didn't you just transmit the data? Transmit? Right. Bonus, book it, vote now. Hey, are you okay? I'm not going to allow it additional right. votes. Once we access the DTD. Um, it doesn't seem doable to me <laughs> in terms of like me doing well, but it at least seems like we can learn something from it and not a... Uh, not, like, need to have excellent recall from a year ago. I mean, that's my bad. I should have I should have made it so that we played it earlier than a year later. But we're going to end the foot percent portion of stream. Um, if you're not going to check out the next Blook It, we'll be back on Thursday for the costume bracket. All of the different outfits that the cage characters wear. It's going to be a, a battle of the fashionistas. So exciting stuff there. And uh, we're going to switch on over to the bonus blicket. Bye, Bob people.